Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the eDrawings Measure Tool. Let's begin by saving our part as an eDrawings document. Let's go to Save and then select Save As. From the Save As Type drop down menu, I'll select an eDrawings document, extension EPRT. Now let's click Options. We're going to check OK to measure this eDrawings file. If you enable this option, the recipient of the document can measure the geometry. Otherwise, the measure tool isn't available. Let's cancel out and go to our eDrawings file now. Here we are. Let's activate the measure tool. On the left, we've got four selection filters. The first selects entities by face. Next is edges. Third is vertices. And the fourth option selects holes. First, let's see how the faces option works. Let's select it to activate it. Now I'm going to select this face here in the graphic area. And this one. In the results window, we see that the normal distance is 43 millimeters. We can specify the type of units to display also. Inches, for example, meters, feet. Let's try inches and angle measurements, we can choose between degrees or radians. To clear your selections, you can just select the entity right in the selection box and then press delete on your keyboard. Or you can just deselect an item by selecting it again in the graphic area. Let's try the select by edges option now. Now we'll select two edges in the graphic area, this edge and this edge. 